Aurora Borealis, a geomagnetic storm. We may know it as the Aurora Borealis or the Northern Lights. Travel across America with me. Well, I might be taking us to the North Atlantic. As I tell you a little bit about this geomagnetic storm, I want to share with you some photographs that friends across America and even the North Atlantic have shared with me in the last 24 hours to provide for this video. And if you've watched any of my videos, you might have come across that I like to try out new coffee shops. And this morning, I went and had an espresso at this brand new coffee shop in Justin. Hang on to the end so you can see a few shots of this very well done brand new coffee shop in Justin, Texas. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Space Weather Prediction Center issues geomagnetic storm warnings. And they say that these can be severe to extreme and they become more intense. And that's when we see these great northern lights and they can be very widespread and even seen at lower latitudes, which they typically are not seen in. Their aurora is usually seen in the northern half of the country, but may be seen as far south as Alabama to Northern California. If you're experiencing clear weather, step out tonight and see what you can see. Many people have told me that the photographs taken by their phones are much clearer and crisper and more colorful than what is seen through the naked eye. So maybe if it doesn't look that exciting, take a picture with your phone. You might see a big difference. But when you get down to it, a full understanding of the physical processes which lead to different types of auroras is still incomplete. Uh. Imagine that. The color red is generally at the highest altitudes and green is at the lower altitudes. Most auroras occur in a band that is known as the auroral zone, which is typically 3 degrees to 6 degrees wide in a latitude between 10 degrees and 20 degrees from the geomagnetic pole. And it's most clearly seen at night against a dark sky. Well, of course it is. Tell me in the comments below if you have been able to experience the northern lights. Don't forget to subscribe. And now I want to remind you that I did previous videos on the Aurora Borealis that showed off in May. And now let me take you to the well done coffee shop I went to today. I ordered an espresso and it came with sparkling water. Boy, this place is classy. It's brand new. It's great. They serve breakfast and dinner on certain days. You'll want to check their schedule. Their patio is terrific. And right now they have a little section where you can decorate your own pumpkin and they have activities out in the yard for guests of all ages. We're at the Justin Coffee and Trading Company. A great stop north of Fort Worth, if you were wondering. Flip-flops on the ground and classic road trip. Don't forget to subscribe and share your photos of the Aurora Borealis, the Northern Lights.